What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Raymond Taco Forever. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm about another video. Before I get into that video, I want to remind everyone that I need a link to a different playlist in every description box. Take time to click on those links, run the views up, run the thumbs up up, run the comments up. And if you feel the need to share the playlist, feel free to share the playlist. If you like my channel or find my channel useful, take a moment to subscribe and turn on post red notifications. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a video. Today I'm about another video. This video is not projected towards my genuine support. If you support my channel on a regular basis and you another YouTuber, this video is not directed at you. This video is directed to the ones that support my channel as spam. Fake pages. You know what I mean? All spam. Yes. This is so the title of this video would be My Past Don't Determine Who I Am Today. My Past Don't Define Who I Am Today. I'm going to say that one more time for y'all loud and clearly. Because this is going to be the only time I address this issue. After this, anything said about the subject, you'll get blocked. Straight like that. That's how I'm coming. So I'm going to say it one more time. My past do not define who I am today. I'll say it one more time for y'all. Just make sure y'all can hear in your head. Make sure the message get through. My past don't define who I am today. You know, as you know, I got a criminal record. Yes, I am a convicted felon. You know what I mean? I'm a one-time convicted felon, thanks to the state of Florida. I'm not going to go into details about it, but I am a convicted felon, and a lot of fake pages, a lot of spammers been bringing it up. You know what I mean? And I'm getting tired of it. You know what I mean? It's not going to work what you're trying to do. It's always people with a fake page or people with fake profile pictures always got to be the ones to do their homework and, and find some dirt on people. You know, they can't just let people live their life and and judge and respect people for the person that they show you they are through youtube they got to go find dirt and come remind you in the comments every chance they get you know but let me tell you one thing yes i do have a record i said it once i'm gonna say it again yes i do have a record and i did a full detailed video on that topic when i first started youtube you know what i mean so that way when it comes up that video won't be able to be found you know what i mean because I got over, I got almost five. I got close to six thousand videos on YouTube. You know, when I bring a subject to YouTube, it's the dead, put it in the grave and leave it there and move forward with my life. You know what I mean? Every topic, every topic I brought on YouTube about my personal life, yes, that's what the reason. Is. YouTube to me, YouTube to me is a bit diary. A bit diary. I can talk about anything I want to talk about and leave it right there. That's me putting it in the grave, using as a memory on YouTube and make money from it, you know, and, you know, that's what the plan is with the whole thing, bring it to YouTube, that means I'm putting the grade, so any topic you see that I bring, in, bring to YouTube from the past or present, it's all to put in, that's when I put in the grades, when I lay to the rest, and we won't discuss it again, now, I know I don't owe nobody explanation about my life or the bad choices I made in life or the good choices I made. I don't owe nobody explanation but the man upstairs and me, myself, and I. You know what I'm saying? I know that. But I wanted to I wanted to address this today since it keep coming up and then down the road, I'm going to address it the same way. All I'm going to say is my past don't define who I am today. Even if I make it big on YouTube and some some big people come to ask me to do interviews. Yeah, I do. I agree to do the interviews. And when that particular topic come up, I would say just this is my past don't define who I am today. And leave it, leave it just like that. Leave it just like that. Every time. You know what I mean? Like, who gave y'all, you know what I mean? Let's, who gave y'all the authority to, to bring up people's past? Who gave y'all the authority to make sure people being honest with their audience on YouTube? You know? Let, let's, let's keep one thing in mind that YouTube is a platform where a lot of people chose to make videos about their everyday life. You know what I mean? And there's no rule to say that YouTube is supposed to get the whole world every aspect of their life. Tell every secret, everything about their life from the day they were born up until the present day. There's no rule to say we have to do that. So if we don't want to discuss everything about our life, we don't have to discuss everything concerning our life, regardless of what it is, regardless of how bad it is, regardless of how good it is, we do not have to discuss it unless we choose to discuss it. So let's keep that in mind. Let me say that one more time for y'all, for y'all fake pages, for y'all spammers that hide behind fake pictures, because you know we met face-to-face. -face. You wouldn't bring that subject up. 
Trust me, I guarantee you, you wouldn't bring that subject up. Once you feel my energy, you don't know. I can't come at him any kind of way. Trust and believe that. You know what I mean? Trust and believe that. You know, the same man that I portray on YouTube, that I show y'all on YouTube, this the man I am 24-7. The energy get real when you face to face with me. The energy get real. And, and a lot of people know you can't come at him any kind of way. You got to choose your word right because you never know when I might pop off. You know what I mean? But like I was saying, you two don't have a rule that said we're supposed to share every aspect of our life with our audience. You know, because I know one of y'all came to come and said, oh, I just want to make sure you be honored with your followers. Like, I don't want to tell them follow, my followers everything about my life. That's not, the, that's not the reason for me being on YouTube. Let's keep that in mind. You know what I mean? And if they're not questioning things, why are you questioning things? You know what I mean? If they respect me for the man that I show them I am on a daily basis, why you can't? It don't matter whether you do or not, because I'm still going to make money. I'm still going to do YouTube content. So it don't really make a difference, but I just want to address this and get out of the way. You know what I mean? I put my pants behind me after I did my time behind that situation, behind my criminal record. I did my time. I paid my restitutions off, and I started a whole new life. There's some criminals in the world that become full-time criminals, and then there's some in the world become part-time criminals, and there's some in the world that become seasonal criminals. And also, there's also some criminals in the world that make bad decisions or become a convicted felon one time and turn their whole life around do a 360. That's what I've done in my life. I became a convicted felon. Thing was hard for a while in Florida, and I turned things around. My life been moving forward since 2015. Nobody had brought my past up since 2015. Actually, since 2012 was the last time my record had me back from getting a job. 2012. We're now in 2024. That's 12 years ago. That's how long it's been since someone used my record against me. So if, if these jobs not using my record against me, or if my record, my record not hurt me for getting an apartment or a house, a condo, a townhouse, or, or getting a good job, why should it hurt me on YouTube? It's not coming up in my everyday life. I'm not going to allow someone on YouTube to continue to bring my past up. Because technically, I don't owe nobody but myself and God an explanation for anything I've done, bad or good, from the day I was born up until the very moment. I don't owe nobody explanation. You know what I mean? So if you can't respect that, it is what it is. I can care less either way. If you can, cool. Continue to support my channel. If you can't, like I said earlier in this video, you bring it up, I'm just going to block you. You know what I mean? It take you, what, 10, 15 minutes? 10 minutes max to start a new Gmail account. There'd be another fake spammer in comments. And it take me one second to click one button and block it. You know what I mean? Like, straight up. You know, it's not going down. As I said, my past don't define the man I am today. My past don't define the man I am today. My past don't define the man I am today. I'm a good father. I'm a hard worker. I have good credit. I'm making good moves in life. I'm doing good in life. And my record had no effect on it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm one of the ones. I know you hate it, but I'm one of the ones that made a fucked up decision in my in my way, in my 20s, and turned this whole life and turned everything around. Turned everything around. You know what I mean? Be proud. You should be proud of that. A lot of people don't, a lot of people can't stand before you and say that. And they made some fucked up decisions in their younger days and turned their whole life around. A lot of people can't say that. A lot of people cannot say that. You know what I mean? And I'm proud of myself. My family not holding my record with my head. No girlfriend has held, a, held my record with my head. I done been married and divorced. I done been engaged three times. Nobody is using, holding my past with my head, even all my friends. Everyone that knows me that know about my record, nobody's holding on my head. Why should you? Why should you? They're not bringing it up. You know what I mean? They nobody not bringing it like, yeah, that man came a long way. Everybody give me my props for how much things that changed in my life since since 2010. Since 2010 to right now, that's what? 2010, 20. That's 14 years. Things have turned around. My life had done a 360 in the last 14 years of my life. What does that tell you? So for this moment forward, let my past be my past and focus on what I show. You know what I mean? Because the people I had to make a bit, a bit change in life, and I'm one of the ones that made a bit change in my life. If you can separate, cool. Because, you know, regardless of you steady bringing up, you can bring it up all you want. You know what I mean? Regardless of whether you're bringing my record up or not, I'm still going to get money. I'm still going to move forward in life. I'm still going to progress in life. It's not going to change nothing that's going on in my life. It's not going to change nothing. I will continue to do everything I'm doing the same way I'm doing it until the day I die. You know what I mean? 
But I am serious about what I say. For this moment forward, anytime my record get brought up in the comments or on my live stream like y'all been doing, yeah, I would definitely block every comment. I would definitely block every spam page. You can keep on creating them. You know what I mean? That make me feel good though that you got the time of day in your everyday life to keep creating new spam pages, new fake pages, just to mention the bag you know about somebody. That made me feel good. That made me feel very important that you got the time of day to do that. You know what I mean? That that really made me feel like, wow, I'm that important to you? Am I that important to y'all? That made me feel good to know that I'm that important. That's why one of y'all that told one of y'all in the comment that, hey, I got a video coming titled, what? My past do not define who I am today. And I hope this message get through. If it don't, I can tell it whether, whether the message get through or not. But I will tell you this is any more mention about my past, my record, I will block it. I'm not trying to hide anything. I did a video on it when I first started YouTube. And I told myself back then, this is how I'm addressing. Every time it came up, this is how I address it, just like this. I tell them just that my past don't define who I am today. You know what I mean? Every blue moon is always a new, new fake page coming up, bringing up my past. And I don't have a problem with it because every time they come up, I'm going to say the same thing. My past do not define who I am today. And if they continue to pursue it, hit that block button. That block button, that block button worked real, real. That block button worked real well in my life. Like straight up, it works very, very good in my life. That block button. I don't mind blocking people. You know what I mean? Thank you for your support. But just support. Just do your job. Your job is to support your favorite YouTube or YouTube as you like watching. Not make sure they're giving YouTube every aspect about their life, every good and bad thing about their life. Your job is to support. That's what you're going to do. Support. Support. Keep the negative comments to yourself and just support. That's simple. Just support. You know what I mean? That's simple. You know? So with that being said, that's all I have to say about this subject. And remind y'all one more time, all fake pages out there, all the ones with the fake pages where your profile picture is just a letter or you got some stupid name. Yeah, this 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 video directed at y'all. I'm gonna remind y'all again. My past don't define who I am today. My past don't define who I am today. My past don't define who I am today. I put my past in the grave. I want to keep it there and continue to move forward with life. It's just that simple. That's all I want to do. I'm living a good life. Lot has come together. I don't plan on ever going back to jail or ever going to prison again ever in my life. I don't care how old I, I live to see. I plan to live a crime-free life. Crime-free. No new charges on my, on, my, on my record whatsoever. I got a clean slate here in Virginia. These jobs not holding my record against me. Uh, my record not hurt me from getting an apartment, a house, a condo, or a townhouse. My record not doing, hurt me from doing nothing I want to do in life. And I'm not about to allow someone on YouTube to continue to bring it up every chance they get through live streams or through comments on my videos. So from this moment forward, after, I'm, after I upload this video, from the moment you watch this video, from there on out, and then mention about my past, my record, you will be blocked. I don't care how many pages you, I don't care how many new YouTube pages you create, I don't care how many new Gmails you create, every last one of them will get blocked. Get blocked. Just that simple. So, if like for a shout out my shout out video the last Sunday in March, tell me in the comments how you feel with this subject. Do you agree with me? Do you not agree? And I give you a shout out my shout out video the last Sunday in March. If you like the story time, take the time to subscribe, like, comment, and share. Make sure you turn on post bell notifications. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a video. I do leave a link to a different playlist in every description box. Take the time to click on those links, run the views up, run the thumbs up up, run the comments up. And if you feel the need to share the playlist, feel free to share the playlist. One more time. You got to gotta make sure the message get through. My past do, don't determine who I am today. My past don't define who I am today. My past don't define who I am today. Any mention about my past? Or any type that I say I'm going to leave in the grave, I want to leave in the grave, whether it's a type of me and Chanel, me and Cena, anything about my past is dead. From this moment forward, it's dead. I'm moving forward with the future. Now, if I focus on what happened in 2010, 2015, and the 90s, I'm worried about today. I'm living in 2024. We're in 2024. That's all I'm focused on. I learned a lot from my past mistakes. I learned a lot from the good. That's all there's lessons learned.